Hello, Prendita. Hello, Edwin. Welcome. Hello, teacher. Welcome, Brendita. <laughs> okay, Edwin is arriving. That's so good. Hello, Ronald. Welcome. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> Brendita, ya la estuvimos extrañando. Decía, ¿dónde está Brendita? Teacher. Hola. Es que tengo enferma a la niña. Oh, my God. ¿Qué tiene? Este pie de que tiene calentura. Y sí. ya la llevo al médico. Mañana la voy a llevar. Sí, ¿y por qué? Eso es peligroso. No la descuida. Sí. La, la no, fiebre hasta son... Que... Sí, hasta que ahora sí voy a tener la cámara, oye. No, it's okay. It's okay, don't worry. It's okay, Brendita. Roxanita, ¿qué tal? Y la estuvimos extrañando también. Oh, Alice is coming. Welcome to your Friday. It's a pleasure to have you here. Today, I didn't give you homework because I am going to give it to you on the weekend, okay? Hoy no di tarea asignada porque la van a hacer el fin de semana porque les va a tomar un poquito más de preparación. Y pueden estar en la casa, lo pueden hacer y todo. <clears throat> es siempre un audio, pero lleva un poquito más de preparation. Okay? So we are going to be doing that. We are going to be doing that during the weekend. And uh, you are going to see that it's going to be, it is going to be a nice homework, an interesting homework. Well, how was your day, people? Tell me three things that you did. Tres cosas que hicieron en su día. Three things that you did today. Uh-huh. Only three. What three things that you did today? Tres actividades. For example, uh-huh. I going to work. Uh -huh. <clears throat> oh, I was, sorry, I was. No, I work, I you say. I work. You can say, for example, if I am asking about activities, and let me get my notebook and on this one, I am going to do it right here. I, I, I really like, to, when I explain, I like to, to make it visible for everybody. So when you say three activities, you can, you can use either the verbs, you can say, for example, you can say work, uh, organize, uh, organize papers and uh, clean, clean the house. And there you have the three activities that you did in the day, right? If you want to use, if you want to use the proper form of the verb, okay? Ahorita porque vamos como en el nivel inicial, me pueden decir solamente las actividades. For example, work, clean, um, take a bus, answer the phone, eh, check WhatsApp, right? You can tell me the activities. Más adelante, cuando ustedes ya me puedan dar detalles, you can say, for example, I, y cuando ya ocupemos los verbos en pasado, right? I worked. I took a bus. I went to work, right? You can use these forms. But this is past tense, okay? Aquí ya estamos ocupando los verbos en pasado. Es este, un, un, una cosita un poquitito más complicada. La van a ver por ahí en unos dos módulos. Quizás por ahí por el módulo 3 van a ver los verbos en pasado. Pero algo importante, si ustedes ya pueden empezar a investigar cosas como esta. Si ustedes dicen, hey, los verbos en pasado, la famosa lista de verbos en pasado. Se la voy a compartir para que lo vayan conociendo ahí al, al, casi al final del módulo. Cuando ustedes pueden ir viendo cómo se transforman los verbos para ser pasado. Ahorita hemos transformado los verbos para hacer una forma. ¿Cuál es la forma que hemos aprendido a transformar? 
¿Cuál es la forma de verbos que hemos aprendido a transformar? A ver. En tercera persona. En tercera persona, right? That you say, for example, work is the, the, the base form, right? There you have works is for third person. Working is for activities that are happening right now. Work is past tense. Had work is uh, present. It's, this is perfect, right? And have work. This is uh, past per. This is present perfect, past perfect, right? And you have all the different forms of the verbs. Okay. Ahorita vamos por aquí en la segunda en la segunda categoría. Works. Después van a ver los progresivos que son los ing. Aquí significa trabajo, trabaja en tercera persona, trabajando, trabajé, trabajó y he trabajado. So, you have like the different tenses. Si ustedes se van metiendo ya un poquito más en la grammar y van investigando estas cosas, por ejemplo, que son más avanzadas, pero cuando usted las va conociendo y usted dice, hey, yo ya leí acerca de eso. Cuando llegue el momento de estudiarlas, ya así como en clase, usted ya las conoce. Entonces es una ventaja. Yo les digo que yo aprendí así cuando yo estaba chiquita ya por mis nueve años. Y yo decía, ¿y qué es eso? Y me metí a ver, ¿y cómo se ocupa? ¿Y qué otra forma hay? ¿Y qué otro verbo se ocupa? ¿Cómo transformo esto? ¿Sí? Y así me fui metiendo. Y así fui aprendiendo. Entonces, les invito a que puedan irlo haciendo. Ahorita vamos a trabajar solamente con la forma básica. You say, three activities that you did today. I have work, organize papers, and clean the house. What are three things that you did today? Tres, tres cosas que hicieron ahora. I take the bus. Uh -huh. I brush my teeth. And? Um, I take a shower. Okay, you say take the bus. Take the bus. Take the bus. Brush, Brush my, my teeth. Brush my teeth. And take a shower. Take a shower. Eat lunch. Eat lunch, right? There you have eat lunch. What else? Another activity that you did today? Eat lunch. What else? Watch TV. Watch TV. Uh -huh. ¿Qué otra cosa hicieron ahora? You take the bus, brush my teeth, take a shower, eat lunch, watch TV, clean the house. Uh -huh. For sure, because you are here. <laughs> si no, no estuviéramos aquí. Connect to the class. What else? Check the platform. Check the platform. Very good. Check the platform. What else? Did you check WhatsApp? Check WhatsApp. To check WhatsApp when you take your phone and you start scrolling up, right? You can check social media as well. Social media is everything. YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, WhatsApp, everything. What else did you do? Give me one example. Repair the machine. You repair machines, right? You repair machines. <clears throat> okay, repair machines. What else? One more. Give me one more activity that you did. ¿Qué más? Una cosa más que han hecho. Only one, only one. <coughs> Hello, Américo, Astrid, Griselda, Normita, Celina, Odalis. No los había saludado. Welcome. Hello. Hi. 
Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> Uh, good, good night. You are sending me to bed already. No, no, no. I know it's Friday, but not yet, right? Not yet. So those are the things that you did today. So in this case, we are going to uh, we're going to use one of these questions, one of these uh, activities, to say, for example, um, when you create sentences, you can say, I work today i organize per papers i don't clean the house i don't take the bus i don't check the platform what is something that you do on the weekends okay vamos a tomar de ejemplo el sábado on saturday let me just change here on saturday on saturday what do you do on Saturday? Ah, uh, on Saturday, I don't work. Yo sí vea, por ejemplo. I don't work. I don't, uh, I don't. I don't sleep. I don't sleep. <laughs> okay, I don't sleep. Se va a parrandear. And I check social media. I check social media, okay? You can say two yes, one no, or two no's and one yes. Escojan. Tienen que escribir tres oraciones usando cualquiera de esos verbos que están aquí. On Saturday. Ahí están mis oraciones. It can be two yes and one no, or two no's and one yes, like my example. I don't work, I don't sleep, and I check social media. Give me... Two yes and one no, or two no's and one yes. Escriban sus oraciones. Escribanlas en el cuaderno para que se les haga más fácil. Pueden poner dos negativas y una afirmativa, o dos afirmativas y una negativa. Con ah. estos ejemplos, o pueden usar sus propios ejemplos. Teacher. Yes. Sure es iglesia, ¿verdad? Church. Yes, church. And in that case, you say, I, eh, for the sentence, you say, I go to church. Go to church. Okay. Whenever you are ready, let me know. Okay. Whoever is ready, let me know. Teacher. Yes. Coworkers es compañero de trabajo. Coworkers, yes. Coworkers. Co I will write it here. Coworkers. There you have it. Coworkers. And classmates is compañeros de clase. Y partners. Partners son amigos. Son como my partners. My partners, you are, you have like a little bit more confidence with them. Porque en muchos casos tenemos como co-workers, que es así de, hola, buenos días, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo está? Bien, ya. Yeah. And that's it, right? Those are co-workers. But with your partner, it's like, hey, bicho, vas a ir a comprar fruta, tráeme. Hey, buena onda. No sé, ya es como más amistad, más confianza, más cherada. Those are partners. And classmates, for sure, are the people who are with you in a class. Okay, examples. Who can share me the examples?
A ver, ¿quién más tiene ya? Edwin, ¿ya los tiene? I don't watch, watch TV. Ajá. Negativa. I check social media. Good. I don't, I don't check WhatsApp. Very good. I so, meet, este, este, este. Uh, that's okay. Está bien. Uh -huh. I meet my boss. O me reuní con el jefe, así se puede. I ah. meet I meet boss. with, I meet with, aquí. Ok, te la voy a escribir. Mm -hmm. I meet with my with. boss. Mm, ya. Yeah. Porque si solo decimos, I meet my boss, it's like, yo conozco a mi jefe. And that's like, what? <laughs> I, uh -huh. I, with. I meet with my boss, with my boss, with my boss. Okay. I meet okay. with my boss. Or I had a meeting, but that's another mm. another form. I meet with my boss. That's that's one form that you can use. Okay. Thank you very much. Let's see. Uh, Evelyn, do you have it? Um, I clean my house. Mm -hmm. I listen to the music. I don't work. I don't work. I clean my house, I listen to music, and I don't work. Griselda. Para decir, uh -huh. para decir, está bien, ¿qué he escrito? I cooked the last week. I? I cooked the last week. Así. I cook the last Cocina. week. Uh -huh. Ajá. Quise escribir, cocinaré el fin de semana. Ah. No, no, no. aquí dice, I cook the last week, yo cocino la semana pasada. Cocino. En oh. este caso, <laughs> cuando lo hacemos pasado, you can say, uh -huh. I cooked. Ya si queremos hacer una oración en pasado, you say, I cook last week. Okay, and this is a form of past tense. Oh, okay. okay. And I will cook es voy a cocinar el fin de semana. Oh. I will cook. Aquí estamos haciendo como qué hacemos el domingo. Say, I cook. I don't cook. That can be okay. an example for this one, okay? Good, but a very good question, Evelyn. Nice. Ronald, go ahead. Okay. On Saturday, I don't work. I play video games all day. And at night, I watch soccer on I, TV. I watch soccer on TV. Very good job. Very good job. Roxana, do you have your examples? Hoy sí lo voy a encender. <laughs> yes. I don't know. Get up early. I don't get up early. That's a good one. <laughs> I clean my house. I don't college homework. <laughs> I don't do. I don't do homework. I, do. <laughs> I don't do homework. It is, it is funny because when you are used to wake up early, okay, cuando ustedes ya están acostumbrados a levantarse a una hora, el cuerpo es tan traicionero que te levanta a la misma hora. <laughs> Or más temprano. It Soy testimonio de eso. Me too. <laughs> Amén, hermano. Me too. <laughs> I do it. Yeah. On Pero vacation. El esfuerzo. <laughs> On vacation, for example. On vacation, I, I, every day I wake up 10 minutes before five every day. So on vacation, I said, I'm going to sleep. Oh, quiero dormir, quiero dormir, quiero dormir. I said, five in the morning. Thank one. <laughs> so I was like, yeah, I don't get up early. No, I, I get up early. Good, very good. Selena, give me your examples. I... <laughs> on Saturday, I don't sure. I don't sure. I don't go to church. I don't go to church. I don't go to church. Uh -huh. I don't go to supermarket. I don't go to the supermarket, uh -huh. I don't know neighbor. Algo así se pronuncia. Ok, neighbor, ¿qué querías decir ahí? I don't... Que, que no visita a mis vecinos. Ah, espera, entonces nos falta el verbo. I don't, y aquí tenemos el verbo. ¿Cuál sería el verbo para visitar? 
visit. Visit. I don't visit King. I don't visit my neighbors. Okay. I don't visit my neighbors, right? I don't visit my neighbor. I think I have <laughs> never visited my neighbors. Look at me. You visit all my vecinos. <laughs> okay. Vecinos. No, no. I never. I don't even know their names. Pero que ellos solo me ven y dicen, ah, la lic. Ah, la que da cosa. But they don't, they don't, I don't know their names or anything. It's just because they listen to me when I am talking, but I don't know them. So let's see. And Americo, go ahead. Americo and then Odalis and then Astrid. And I am going to finish with Carolina. Okay, that's the order. Go Americo. Yo pensé que ni me tomaba en cuenta como me dijeron que eso duraba. Ay, solo era sentido. Américo. No, me habla de sentido. Para mí todos ustedes son importantes, así que no digan nada. Vamos. Yo le voy a decir una que ya me la quitaron, me la quitó Roxana. It's okay, it's your example. Go ahead. I don't wake up early. I don't wake up early, good. Uh, I don't work. Mm -hmm. I don't drive to work. I don't drive to work. I don't work and I don't wake up early. Very good job. Next. The next one. Next. Astrid, vamos. Um, I don't work. I don't know the bus. I check social media i clean my house i clean my house i check social media i don't take the bus the bus okay mm. good the next sentence it's for odalis odalis miss odalis hello hello i can see your camera sweetheart i cannot see you hoy no veo a, a luisito ni a celina se me va, se me pierde. Brendita, porque yeah, está en una ocasión especial. Vamos, yes. La vez es tan buena. It's okay, go ahead. Show um, me. I wash my clothes. Uh -huh. uh, I, I watch the movie. Uh -huh. um, I ate the chicken. You take the chicken. Sí. Comer you, pollo. Ah, I eat chicken. No. I eat no, chicken. chicken. I take the chicken. It's like meal <laughs> and run. <laughs> yeah, it happens, right? It's like the apoyo sin correa de quien lo vea, right? But it's okay. No. <laughs> so I eat chicken. Brendita Martinez, go ahead. I do not rex. I do not rest. Uh -huh. I do not study. I do not study. I do not work. Okay. I don't rest. I don't study and I don't work. Good job. Very good job, Brandita. Carolina, vamos. And then Luis Parrilla. Me acabo de incorporar, teacher. We are doing sentences. Okay. Pongamos sí. atención a las oraciones que estamos haciendo y vuelvo con usted. Vamos con Luis Parrilla and then Norma. Luis anda vagando, ya lo caché. Ajá. Y nosotros, esa casa no es suya, ¿no? ¿Dónde andan? <risa> no estoy en casa, pero aquí estoy conectado. Ok. Ok. <risa> okay. No entra tampoco a tiempo, pero creo que están diciendo los verbos, las oraciones, pero. Ya, yeah, en afirmativo o negativo. Ok. Eh, Saludaré. I don't work, mm -hmm. uh, I don't watch TV, mm -hmm. I don't take the bus, and I check social media. I check social media. Great job, Luis. Very good job. And <laughs> let's go with, I'm missing one. Who am I missing? Ah, Normita. Go ahead. And then Carolina. Uh, I brush my teeth. 
I don't wash my face. I don't go to bed. I don't go to bed. Okay, good. Rocio, did you tell me your sentences? I don't eat breakfast. I don't eat breakfast. Uh -huh. Eat breakfast. I exercise in the morning. I don't cook the chicken. I don't cook chicken. Very good. Now, Carolina, give me your examples. Uh, I clean the house. Uh -huh. uh, I... Uh, I don't organize. Ah, organize. No, uh, I organize in the house. Uh, I, 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 organize, I, I organize the house. The house. Uh, I go shopping. I go shopping. I go shopping. Good. I go shopping. Am I missing someone? Se me queda alguien sin participar? No. Hable ahora o calle para siempre. Griselda. Qué honrado son mi estudio. I, <laughs> I go to the supermarket. I visit my mom. And I don't eat breakfast with my partner. I don't eat breakfast with my partner. <laughs> yeah. Every week we, we eat breakfast with our partners. But not on Saturday. Good. Very good job. So. We are going to work a little bit on an exercise that I have here. I am going to exercise your brain today. In this one, I have two pictures. I have two pictures. I need you to find differences on the pictures. How are the pictures different from each other? So you can you can um, you can mark it. You can tell me the form, the picture, the face, the hair. The apple different colored. The which one? The apple. The apple is a different Yellow. color. Exactly like that, Yellow, right? Red. The apple has a different color. Right here we have one. Another the, one. The clock. A different time. The clock has a different time. The plane. The plane, right? The plane is missing. Very good. We don't have the plane. Uh, the, picture. the picture in the work. The different. picture in the wall is different. Very good. La barbita, señor. <laughs> How do you say barbita? How do you say barbita? Uh -huh. The different colors. Uh, La chaqueta o el... The jacket different. The jacket is different. Which jacket? The man, the, the right. No, how do you say right? The stripe. The jacket. Right? The jacket yes. is different, right? This is the mustache. The mustache. The shirt is different. The shirt. The color de la chaqueta que está eh, al otro lado. Uno es verde y el otro es celeste. Very good. La, the jacket. Right? La corbatita. The okay. pants, the, tie. the pants, the men. Okay, wait, the wait, green, wait. Uh, uh, blue pot. The pants. Okay, what, let's go pants. one by one. The pants, pants. are different. Pants. Yeah. It's different color. Chair and the chair. Green. Which chair is different? Chair. The chair. The chair. The chair. <laughs> okay, the plant. The plant is different. The notebook. The notebook. Una es orange y la otra es brown. Okay, the tie. The notebook. The notebook. The tie. Very good. The pens. The pens. The pencil. Which pencils? Ah, oh, yeah, the pencils are not here. They are different. The hair is different. Which Teacher, hair? Yes. The notebook. The notebook. Ah. Other, 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 other. Yes. This. Yeah, she is happy and this is sad. Right? Yes. The señor también está viendo para otro lado. 
Yeah, this man is looking on the opposite side, right? He's looking on the opposite direction. Let's see, what else? Los lentes. Oh, the glasses, right? He has glasses here and he doesn't have glasses here. What no else? No sé si es libro o es calculadora, pero uno es eh, como verde. Y el otro es celeste, exactly like that. It's a cell phone. There is one more. Eh, la taza que tiene o vaso, uno tiene como cuchara y la otra no tiene nada. Very good, right? You are very observative. Y la otra ruedita de, de la silla de la señora. Otra ruedita de silla de la señora. My goodness. Oh, yes. There you go. It's missing. Ajá. Which one? Yeah, I have it right here. Yes, one and one. Sure. Ah, this one. Yeah, it's true. Uh -huh. sure, the building, the, the window. There you go. Right, the windows on the building. They are building. different. Hey, very good. Another one. The hairs. The chairs. El cabello de. Del de Celeste. El cabello del de Celeste. Oh, yes. This is brown and this is yellow. Yellow. Is very good. Anything else? También está más, más feliz el señor de, de que está la <laughs> Yeah. This one is not that happy, right? Than this one. La planta. En los edificios hay yeah. una, una casita diferente. Wow. In the plant, right? The plant is missing one space. I and need one more. This one. Uh huh. El sillón de, 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 la, de, la, de la señora de chaqueta roja. Ajá. Ah, sí. Tiene el, 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 donde pone los brazos, uno tiene el otro. Ah, no. yes, exactly like this one, right? We don't have it. Ajá. Uh -huh. Another one. No, me. That's it, right? Those are the different. El pantalón del señor de chaqueta verde. This is red. Very good. Color. Okay. No more. <laughs> esta está a la derecha y esta está a la izquierda. The pictures. <laughs> okay. Very good job. You did a very good job. You know, why did I choose no. this example? ¿Por qué creen que los puse a buscar detalles en las fotos? In an English class. Bravo. That you might say like, but why teacher, why? Because English is exactly like this. Así como ven esto de aquí es el inglés. You have to be very careful, very observative. You have to take care of the details. So English is like that. Los puse a buscar diferencias porque así como fueron de observadores al encontrarlas, así tienen que ser ustedes cuando estén trabajando. Cuando estén escribiendo una oración, cuando estén haciendo un párrafo, cuando estén haciendo un trabajo. Se dice, no, no, no. I remember that the teacher told me that it's like this. La teacher nos explicó que va así. Sigue este orden, sigue este patrón. So you need to be very careful, very observative. And I really like that you enjoy it, right? You are exactly like me. Ustedes son visuales, igual que yo. I really like that. So that was a, a very good thing. Well, I am going to call the attendance right now. Te voy a pasar lista. And remember, when you listen to your beautiful name, say here or present. I am going to go here. Then we're going to check on the manual. No para el manual, así que si lo tienen por ahí a la mano, lo pueden ir abriendo para que van trabajando con él. Okay, so I will go here. Astrid Abigail. Present teacher. Thank you. One second. Okay. Astrid. Hi, there is Anya. Sanya. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Take it easy. Okay, so I go with Aide, Brenda Elizabeth Ceron, that she's here. Brenda Elizabeth Martinez. Present. Selena Janet Arevalo. Selena. Selena. Present, teacher. 
Thank you. Diana Carolina Melendez. Edwin Ernesto. Present. Evelyn del Carmen. Present. Cristel Dayamilet. Here. Isabel Rocío. Present. José Antonio. Luis Américo. Luis Humberto. Marta Alicia. Martita. Norma Yamilet. Present. Odalis Marisol. Present. Ronald Ulises. Present. Roxana de Jesús. Present. En Yolanda Beatriz. No present. Okay, good. So, as I told you, we're going to work right now on the manual. We're going to go and work a little bit on the exercises that we have been doing, right? We have been working a lot, a lot, a lot on the different things, on the sentences, the practices, et cetera, right? So, today is going to be kind of a review of all the things that we have been doing during these days, right? We were studying the WH questions yesterday Ayer estuvimos estudiando las WH questions. What do I do? Where do I work? When do, you, when do we go? How do they plan? What time do you take breakfast? And the answers, what do I do? I supervise the production workforce. Todo el cuerpo de trabajo y toda la producción. Where do you work? I work in the accounting department. The next one. When do we go to the meetings? We go to the meetings two times a week. How do they plan the marketing? They investigate the customer's needs. What time do you take breakfast? I take breakfast at 8 a.m., right? I take breakfast at 8 a.m. What do I do? ¿Qué haces? And in this one, for sure, you are going to tell me an activity that you do. Where do you work? Un lugar. I work in the accounting department. Yeah. When do we go to the meeting? Es eso? <laughs> okay, it's okay, it's okay. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> eh... <laughs> How do they plan the marketing? They investigate the customer's needs. What time do you take breakfast? The time I take breakfast at 8 a.m. In this one, we are going to create the questions based on the answers, right? We're going to create the questions based on the answers and we are going to do the following. I have to write a report about the production every Friday. What question do you consider necessary for this answer? I work in the blue building. I work in the blue building, in the blue building. Uh, I have to write the report every Friday. Maria and I start working at 10 p.m. We design and others create the new product. They have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows and outflows. There you go. What questions do you think we need to make in order to have these answers? ¿Qué preguntas tendríamos que hacer para que yo les responda? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What, what do you do? Would... What do you do production every day? Algo así. Mm. Ahí vamos, ahí vamos. Estamos do you dando... write a report? Do you write a report? Yes. On the answer you have every Friday. What do you have to write? write a report every Friday. Ajá, si decimos, what do you have to write a report? Ahí ya nos estamos respondiendo. Um, vamos bien, vamos bien. What, what do you... Ajá. 
What do you have, have to, to do? To do every every Friday. Oh, sorry, sorry. Friday is with capital letter. What do you have to do every Friday? What do you have to do every Friday? Oh, I have to write a report about the production every Friday. And here you have another form of question. How often? How often do you write a report? How often do you write a report? ¿Qué tan seguido escribes un reporte? I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Cada viernes. Right? I have to write every Friday. I work in the blue building. ¿Qué me tienen que preguntar para que yo les responda que yo trabajo en el edificio azul? I work in the blue building. Where do you work? Where do you work? Exactly like that. Yeah. Where? Where do you work? Where do you work? I work mm -hmm. in the blue building. Right? I work in the blue building. Oh. Maria and I start working at 10 p.m. ¿Qué pregunta tendríamos que armar ahí? What time? What time? Do Maria and you. Ajá, in that case, ¿por qué lo reemplazarían para poner, no poner Maria and you? And me. What time do you start working? Pero aquí podríamos hacerlo como se puede tender a confundir. Si solo decimos, what time do you start working? Si estamos con las dos personas, no hay problema. Podemos decir, what time do you start working? Y señalan a ambos, right? Porque puede ser you, plural, dos o más. And we can have, específicamente, what time do Maria and you start work? And then you have the question. What time do Maria and you start working? So it's, but the best it will be for you, right? Recuerden que hay dos formas para uso de you. Ya sea you de segunda persona y you de plural. All of you, decimos nosotros. Todos ustedes. Sería el ustedes de inglés. We design. Yes. And start and work son dos verbos. Ajá. Uh -huh. Pero start, entonces hace que el segundo verbo se convierta como en ing. No, no, no. En este caso, el start es el complemento del verbo. Ese sería un verbo compuesto. Start working. Como cuando yo le digo, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Porque go and sleep son dos verbos distintos, right? But in this case, you use compound verbs. Son estos verbos compuestos que decimos, start working, start cooking, start eating. Right? Those are like phrases. Ahí ya se nos hacen como, como frases que podemos ocupar, pero son los dos verbos combinados. Pero el segundo verbo iría en terminación con ing. En este sí. ¿okay? Porque aquí decimos a qué hora empiezas o inicias a trabajar. Yo inicio mm. mi trabajo a tal hora, pero es esta frase. Start working. I start working at 10 in the morning. No decimos comienzo trabajando sino que el significado es a qué horas comienzas a trabajar. Pero es la frase ya prehecha, pre start working. Entonces, ahí es donde la usamos así. So, we design and others create the new product. What question would you make for that one? We design and others create the new product. How will you make it? What question will you make there? ¿Cómo hacemos esa pregunta? Uh -huh. 
we design and others create the new product? It can be cool. what, right. what do you do in your job? What do you do in your job? We design and others create the new product. ¿Qué haces en tu trabajo? They have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows and outflows. ¿Cómo damos, qué, qué usamos para dar una razón, un por qué? Why. Why, very good. Why, why what? Why do you have, why do you have what? A meeting. Why do you have a meeting? Oh, in this case, why do you know? It's why do. It's not why do you. It's why do they have a meeting? Why do they have a meeting? They have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows and outflows. And there you have the forms of sentences. Okay. A little bit challenging, but not really impossible. Okay. Ya le sacaron un screenshot de las preguntas, ya las ya copiaron, ¿no? Pantalla. You can just a screenshot. It's beautiful. I know. Gracias, yo sé. Me lo digo acá. I know, I know. Si, si algo me puso mi mamá cuando me hizo fue ego. <laughs> yeah. No, I always say that. Don't worry, don't worry. It's okay. Ustedes hagan lo que yo hago todas las mañanas. Cuando se levanten, ustedes van al espejo y dicen, ¿y quién es esa belleza? Ah, che, soy yo. Sorry. <laughs> you do it every day. Ahí se tiran un par de besos. Después. No, se tiran un par de besos ahí. Ustedes y se quieran... quiebra después. <laughs> no, sigue intacto. <laughs> América, usted levántese y dígale, todos me quieren, soy importante, me aman. And we no. do do it, for sure. Diego, eso no dura los espejos aquí. Ay, América. Todos te queremos, Américo. We love Américo, eh? corazoncito para mí. Oh. <laughs> we have, right, and we created the questions. What, when, where, why, and who. Right, these are the different questions that we can use. What is for general things? When is for days, where is for places, why, reasons, and who, for people. Gentes. <laughs> for people, it's for people, right? Who is for people? And here we have a conversation. I need you please to get one object that you have near you. Busquen un objeto, cualquier objeto que tengan ahí que ustedes consideren bonito. Vayan a buscarlo. Go ahead. For an object that you consider pretty, that you say, hey, this is nice. Okay, let me find one. Um, um, okay. Uh, I don't have a, an object, but let me find one. Busquen un objeto, yo tengo como 800 mil cosas aquí. Oh, I got one here. Good, 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 good. Okay, I have backpacks and everything. Okay. There it is. Can you show me your object? Ah, oh, it's, it's green. Oh, sorry. There you go. <laughs> this is it's LED. No, it's un tecolote. Ah, <laughs> tecolote. <laughs> Look at this one. Okay, I have my object. Do you have your object? Can I see it? Muestrenme su objeto. Let me see. Show me your object. Show me your object. Oh, what a beautiful ring. Roxana, nice. Oh, Astrid. I have one exactly like that one. Yo tengo un igualito. Uh-huh, your object, Evelyn. Míralo. <laughs> Very good. Ahí tengo lo que lo voy a ocupar. Norma. Uh -huh. What is your object? A pen. I. Astrid. Oh, your your your. Okay, your watch. Griselda. What is your object? Okay, a Mickey Mouse thing. Edwin. What is your object? 
<laughs> a pillow. <laughs> Very good. Isabel, what is your object? Okay, good. And let me see. Odalis, what is your object? Carolina, what is your object? Okay. <laughs> Okay, Américo, what is your object? Para los que sí me dieron corazón, vaya. Uh, <laughs> good, keep it there, keep it there. Odalis, I need to see your object. Odalis, no veo su objeto. Uy, un camarote anoche. <laughs> what is it? ¿Qué es? I, can, I cannot see it, Odalis. Yes. Es un pantalón. Okay, good. It's your object. It's your object. Vamos a hacer un viaje a un país donde los objetos tienen diferentes usos. Y ese objeto que ahora tienen en su mano es su teléfono. I have it right here. El Pluto, quiero ver el Pluto. There you go, America has, this is your phone, okay? So we're going to practice the conversation right now. We are going to practice the conversation with someone and I am going to start. The conversation I am going to start with uh, Carolina, because I love your, your, your Pluto. <laughs> hey, Carolina, hello, Carolina, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Carolina. What, what do you have to do on Thursday, Carolina? Te estoy, estoy hablando por teléfono, Carolina. Uh -huh. What do you have to do on Thursday? I just check the production for the new product and white a report above in white. Uh, because I need someone to help me to move some boxes. Can you do me that favor? Sure. What is about? Uh, what does uh, What does Mr. Reese have to do that day? Oh yeah, I know. I'm not so sure. Okay. Uh, what time does he finish uh, work on Thursday, or when does he have free time? I don't know. You have to say. I don't know. Okay. Well, wait, wait. I will call someone else. Bye, 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 Carl. Bye, bye. bye, -bye. <laughs> Let me call, let me call Astrid. <laughs> Hi Astrid, how are you? Mira la Astrid, ahí no faltó barrio, Fese. Yo me lo hubiera puesto en el barrio. Oh, hi. What, what do you have to do on Thursday? The production for the new production. Um, why um, report about with... why why ah because i need someone to help me move some boxes can you do me that favor wait 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 tengo interferencia espérame <laughs> well what does mr reese have to do that day no so 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 Sure, sure, sure. Acordate, sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, let me call someone else. Thank you. Bye bye. Pip, pip, pip. Nadie sabe, my God. <laughs> let me call Ed, Edwin Ernesto. Ay, lo cambió, el... El no, 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 it's a pillow. Ahí, claro. Era ese, con ese llegamos al mundo y con ese nos quedamos. Your bueno, people. pues. Hi. Mi, mi teléfono. Ahorita Hello. vamos a hablar. Hi, what do you have to do on Thursday? I, cha I just check the production for the new product and write a report about its why. Why? Uh, because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me that favor? Sure. What is about? Well, what does Mr. Reese have to do that day? I know, sure. no, I'm not so sure. Uh, and what time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? Do you know? I don't know. Oh my God. Let me call someone else. Wait. <laughs> Thank you, Edwin. Bye. Bye. 
Norma, Norma Yamilet dice que, okay, Norma Yamilet, pip, pip, pip. Norma Yamilet, hi, how are you? Norma, what do you have I, to do on Thursday? I just checked the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? I, because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me that favor? Sure. What is it about? Wait, yeah, do, what does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I know so sure. And uh, do you know what time does he finish work on Thursday or when does he have free time? I don't know. I, I will call someone else. Bye bye bye. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. Ronald, can you call Griselda, please? Oh, you're in Europe yet, Ronald? Where is it? <laughs> ¿Y tu objeto dónde está? Ay, ay, qué, qué casualidad. Uh, <laughs> Griselda, Griselda, what is your object? Ah, uh, your Mickey Mouse. Okay, go ahead. ¿Quién es quién? I don't know. You, 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 I, I told you to call her. Entonces, tú, tú inicias. Uh, <laughs> what, did you, what did you have to do on Thursday? I just check the product for the new product. Ah, voy a empezar otra vez. <laughs> Se cortó la llamada. Me perdí. Ronald, Ronald, can you call, can you call Griselda, please? Bye bye. Go. Tu saldo es insuficiente para completar el tema. El usuario al que llamó está fuera de servicio. Go ahead. Action. <coughs> Uh, hello, Griselda. What did you have to do on Thursday? Hi, I just checked the production for the new product and write a report about it. Why? Because I need some to help me move some boxes. Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is about? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do, have to do today? I'm not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? I don't know. Okay, bye bye. Bye. Let me see. Well, no one knows. No one knows about it. My God. Let me ask Selena. Selena. Selena, tuk, 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 tuk. Selena. Oli. Oli. <risa> Imagínese su jefe llamando que le diga. Oli. <risa> bueno, yo les contesto así a mis teachers a veces. Oli. <risa> What do you have to do on Thursday, Selena? <risa> Selena. No me oyes, What? <laughs> What do you have to do on Thursday? Me escucha bien. Yes, sí te escucho. <laughs> I can listen. To it. Hasta Kaiser escucha. <laughs> Suelten a Kaiser, hombre. I go. I go check the production for the new drugs and write a report about it we or who why why, <laughs> why? <clears throat> i just check the production for the new product and write a report about it why you say because i need someone to help me move some boxes can you do me that favor sure what, what is the book about what is it about? What is it about? Well, what does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I am not so sorry. Sure, sure. I am not sure. so sure. Come on, sure. I sure. am not so sure. What time does he finish to work on Thursday? Or when does he have free time? I am not. I don't know. I, okay, I'm going to call someone else. Thank you very much. Beep. Le voy a llamar a todo el grupo, fíjense. I am going to make a group call. Vamos a hacer una llamada grupal. 
Okay, everybody, contest it. Everybody, pip, 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 pip. Uh, hello. Hello. Hi, Hi, how are you? Hi, People, what do you have to do on Thursday? I just, just check the production for the new product. Just check the production for the new product and run a report about them. Why? Why? Why, Carolina? Me oye, no tiene el Pluto encendido. Enciende el, enciende el Bluetooth. Enciende el Bluetooth. El Bluetooth. Ah, uh, because I need someone to help me move some boxes. Can you do me that favor? Sure, sure. What sure. Is sure. What about? About? Uh, well, first, what does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? I, I am in the And shoe. what time does he finish to work on Thursday? Do you know? Or when does he have free time? I don't know. I don't know. I do you know. So I think I am going to call him. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, class. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Pueden guardar sus teléfonos, no sé que se lo roben. <risa> imagine, imagine you on the, on the bus with that. Imagínense ustedes en la costa. Ya voy a quebrar este teléfono. Hi, how are you? <risa> yeah. Carolina puede decir, le compré un cover al teléfono. <risa> that was so beautiful, ok. So, remember, when you make the questions, let me just silence the Sorry, because I will go and explain. Yes, there you go. So I said, uh, when you are doing the questions, and it says like, what do you have to do on Thursday? And remember that as you are asking a question, you have to give the intonation of the question. What do you have to do on Thursday, right? So you are waiting for an answer. What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? What time does he finish work on Thursday? When does he have free time, right? You have to make the question form. So like, what do you have to do on Thursday? And I'm waiting for an answer. What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? What time does he finish work? When does he have free time? So the intonation is important. Practice with me. And now you can open the microphones. What do you have to do on Thursday? What do you have to do on Thursday? Okay, ahora lo hacemos corrido con la entonación de la pregunta. What do you have to do on Thursday? 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 What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? What does Mr. Ruiz have to do that day? Okay. Can you do me a favor? 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 A favor? No. Can you do me a favor? ¿Me puedes hacer un favor? Can you do me a favor? What is it about? What is it about? What is she about? What is it about? What is she about? Is she about? Okay. Imagínense que yo lo puedo invitar a una obra de teatro, pero me dice, hey teacher, what is it about? Para ver si voy o no, right? What is it about? It about. Or, or if I say, hey, let's go. What is it about, teacher? Let's go to Cinemark what to watch a movie. What is, what is it about? it about, teacher? It's about pictures. Pictures, pictures, cool picture. Yeah, it's about pictures. I know, no, Mr. It's about. What time does he finish work on Thursday? What time? What time does he finish work on Thursday? What time does he finish work on Thursday? When does how? When does he have free time? 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 I have a question for you. When? When? Alguien está dando duro por ahí. Y hasta con el hombro. 
no molestando. ¿Cómo está aprendiendo inglés? Hasta con el lomo. <risa> Hasta con el lomo. Tell me, people, when do you have free time? When do you have free time? When, 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 do, you when, when do you have to do? Tristan? No, no, no. When do you have free time? I am asking you. Free time. I am asking you. Mm. This is this question is for you. When do you have free time? Wow. On Mondays, on, on Tuesdays, Sunday. on Saturdays, on Sunday, on Sundays, right? On Sunday. On Sundays. Morning, afternoon, evening. All day. You say? All, all day. day. So all day, you're free all day. Free if all I day. ask, if I ask Griselda, Griselda, when do you have free time? Cuando tenés tiempo libre. <laughs> On Sunday. On Sunday, morning, afternoon, all the day? All day. <laughs> all day, okay. Let's go to church. I am busy that day. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, Astrid, when do you have free time? Um, when do you have free time? ¿Cuándo te queda tiempo libre a ti? Monday. On Mondays. Good. Mm -hmm. On Mondays. What about Evelyn? When do you have free time? No, never. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not for the church. Don't worry. <laughs> when do you have free time? On Saturday. On Saturdays. Morning, afternoon. Um, in the afternoon. In the af afternoon. 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 Afternoon, no. Afternoon. Ronald, when do you have free time? Saturday and Sunday. All Saturdays day. and Sundays all day. Wow, beautiful. Selena, when do you have free time? Sunday. Sundays. Okay. Roxana, when do you have free time? Sunday afternoon. On Sunday afternoon. Okay, vamos a practicar el ratón vaquero para el día de las madres. On Sunday. Sunday morning. <laughs> the choreography. So, if you ask me, how would you ask me the question? Ask me the question. When do you have free time? When do you have free time? Eh... On Wednesdays, that's my day off. Es mi único día libre, Wednesday. Libre. <laughs> so, All on day? Wednesday. No, only in the morning and in the afternoon because in the evening I have classes. So, and Sunday afternoon sometimes, but I am not free. <laughs> well, so that is a good form of question. Let's continue with them, right? Let's continue with the questions. I have here, I have here a couple of uh, examples. We are going to complete the sentences. How would you complete the sentence? Albert have to do on Thursday. You say, what do or what does? What if you're talking what about does. Albert, does. what does, does. okay? <laughs> Por qué ocupamos does? Porque Albert, él. Es él. Albert es él. It's he, right? Aquí, what type of subject do we have? ¿Quién es nuestro sujeto? Kevin. 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 No, Kelvin, no. Kevin. We does. We? Why? Why? Why does Why does Kevin? Why does Kevin? Kevin. What is the subject in this sentence? Do you, do you, who exactly. Do you, who do you think is going to help Kevin? You. So I gave you oh, the answer. Ya le di la respuesta. Who do you? <laughs> Mr. Ruiz. <laughs> What does, what does Mr. Ruiz, right? Because Mr. Ruiz is he. What does Mr. Ruiz do on Thursday? Okay. 
And in this one, why does Kevin need help? In this one, it's based on the conversation. Why, why does Kevin need help? ¿Por qué necesita ayuda Kevin? What is he going to do? Why does Kevin need help? Because. Uh -huh. He needs. He needs. He needs someone to help him someone to help to help him right? he needs someone to help him move some boxes right and the next one uh, what does mr reese do on thursday what does Mr. Reese do on Thursday? Hmm. What does I Mr. Reese do on Thursday? I don't know. I am not sure. That's the answer because we don't have a specific information. Who do you think is going to help Kevin? Who is going to help Kevin? Who is going to help Kevin? ¿Quién va a ayudar a Kevin? Albert. Albert is going to help Kevin, right? Can you do me a favor? Sure. What is it about? Okay. You say, sure. What is it about? Nunca digan sure a un favor hasta que se lo expliquen. Okay. He's like, can you do me a favor? Sure, yes. Okay, can you give me $100? No, thank you. Sure. <laughs> you cannot do it. Sure. Sure is like, claro, como va a creer que no confía en mí. It's like, anóteme. Corre. Ensure. No, ensure, no. This is. No, es que yo para no. Ah, yeah. Sure. Sure. <laughs> sure. That's what you need to remember, right? Ensure. Sure. <laughs> sure. <laughs> And in this one, we have more information questions. We have more examples. Can you help me to read the first uh, paragraph or the first line of examples? Isabel, can you help me with number one, this one? What does? What does? What does she do on Saturday, on Sunday? Evelyn, what does she do on Saturday and Sunday? Huh? <laughs> huh? He visit other companies and has meeting. What is the pronunciation of this one? Company. Companies. Companies. Companies, right? She visits mm -hmm. other companies and has meetings. The next question, Luis Parrilla, go ahead. Edwin, help me with the next question. Where does? Where does? Mr. Edwin, your microphone. Y Selina me la va a responder. Vamos, Edwin. The question and Selina, the answer. Edwin. Se me perdió Edwin o no me escucha. Ahí va. Hola, hola, aquí estoy ya, ahorita. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Question. Es wish. Which no, department where, where, where? does no where, where where does he go to Tuesday afternoon? Where does where he does go? He go he go on, on Tuesday on, afternoon. Tuesday or Tuesday? Tuesday. 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 Where does he he go Tuesday afternoon? And uh, go ahead with the answer, Selena. He goes to the company, companies, headquarters. 
headquarters. Headquarters es la oficina central, right? He goes to the company's headquarters. Good. Astrid, the next question. To the company's headquarters. Good. The next question. Which? Y Ronald la contesta. Which department does does or boss supervise? Ronald? Or boss supervise the marketing department. Okay, supervises. Supervises. Griselda, the question and let me see. Norma, the answer. What time does Miguel start to work? Very good. Norma? Miguel starts to work at nine o'clock. At nine o'clock. Very good. <clears throat> So in this one, I need you please to create the questions. These questions are missing the auxiliary and uh, they need to be complete. We have, why we have a meeting? I need you to help me to fix them, right? Fix the sentence. What is the correct form of it? I am going to help you with the first one. The first sentence will be the first question, why? Does he have a meeting? Why does he have a meeting? And what about the second one? Create the second one, write it down, number three and number four. Escriban las siguientes tres. Please, if you can send it on the chat, that would be perfect. ¿Me los pueden mandar al chat de Zoom, por favor? Go ahead. I need you to send me the sentences. Send me the sentences on the chat. Two, three, and four. Okay, give me one second. I just need to get my bottle of water. Solo I cancel me what they want. Give me a second. Okay, remember to send it to me on the chat. I need to send, I need you to send them on the chat in Zoom. Teacher, ¿qué significa employee? Employee. Employee. Employee mm -hmm. es empleado. Empleado. Mm, okay. It's he or she. Employee. The employee. Okay, she, she, she. Remember that you are using she in that question, Roxanita. ¿Qué nos falta ahí si estamos ocupando she como sujeto? ¿Qué auxiliar vamos a utilizar? Thank you, Ronald. Teacher, en el chat de Zoom lo vamos a mandar. 
Yes. Justo aquí donde le voy a mandar una carita a todos ahorita. Very good. We need to fix it. Where does? Okay. She proceso. What does Ingrid do on Wednesday? Wednesday is con mayúscula. Todos los días de la semana son con mayúsculas. Where does she process the payments? Very good. Where dones? Does. And the question mark, América. Recuerden las preguntas. Al final siempre llevan el signo de pregunta. What does Ingrid do on Wednesday? Very good. It's Wednesdays, con S. Wednesdays. The next one. What? <laughs> when, do, when does employees? Okay, where does she process the payments? Payments. Payments. Roxanita. Careful. So, this exercise, why did I do it? ¿Por qué les hice este ejercicio? Porque la plataforma es así. Una letra mal puesta, un spelling mal escrito, una palabra cambiada, and the sentence is not correct. Okay? Si puso Wednesday y era Wednesdays, incorrect. Right? Si puso thou es en vez de does, incorrect. Si no le puso mayúscula al principio, incorrect. Where does she process the payments? Very good job. Fantastic. When does employee, employee is con M, employees. Right, employee. What does Ingrid do on Wednesdays? Wednesdays con mayúscula. Okay. What does employee acquire? Employee, right? We have to be very careful on that one. Where does she process the payments? Beautiful. Where does she process the payments? Beautiful. So that's the idea, right? You need to be very careful at the moment of typing. Ay, que lo estaba escribiendo rápido, teacher. Pero pasó una hora peleando con la plataforma por no tener ese cuidado. So we need to be very, very careful with that. Where does she process the payments? Fantastic. So, what does Ingrid, Ingrid, Norma, nos vemos una vez, Ingrid. Ingrid. When does employee acquire the raw material? When, con mayúscula al principio. Americo, we need to check that one, okay? Where does she process the payments? What does Ingrid do on Wednesday? When? You're looking for Isabel Rocio. When es con N, no con M. Okay, we need to be very careful with this one. Right, when? When? What does Ingrid do on Wednesdays? Wednesdays, Evelyn con mayúscula. Wednesdays. So I am going to write it for you. Where does she process the payments? And the question, right? What does Ingrid, Ingrid con mayúscula porque es nombre propio, what does Ingrid do on Wednesdays? The question mark. And the last one, 
when does when let me see when does employee acquire the raw material okay and there you have it. When does employee acquire the raw material and the question mark? And here, so those are the questions. Thank you for all the ones who sent me the messages. Let's see the last ones. What does Ingrid do on Wednesdays? Very good job, you did it nice. When does employee acquire the raw material? Beautiful. And what does Ingrid do on Wednesdays? Ah, Edwin, la principio, what con capital? But it was good. Okay. And where does where does have a meaning? Why? El primis, el, la primera es why. What does Ingrid? Y aquí nos comemos un do. What does Ingrid do on Wednesdays? And where do? Where does employee acquire the raw material? When does employee acquire the raw material? When does employee acquire the raw material? It will. There you go. Ya la chequeé. Al principio, Ingrid, capital letter, okay? So, you need to be very careful at the moment of working on the platform. Así como les, les estuve corrigiendo yo, eso es lo que pasa en la plataforma. Un error, una letra, una cosa mala, and it's not okay. So, we need to be very, very careful on this one. Here I have a little schedule. This is called schedule, right? This is called schedule schedule a schedule is activities that you do in a specific time of the day is your schedule schedule go with me schedule 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 no schedule no schedule 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 Schedule. 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 Okay, I don't know how to pronounce it. Schedule. 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 Your schedule, schedule is when you have your own agenda with the times and the activities that you do every day. For example, what is happening in Mrs. Robles at nine in the morning? ¿Qué va a estar haciendo at nine in the morning? Workshop to the research and development department, department to implement the student Okay, she's going to be in a workshop. What is a workshop? ¿Qué es un workshop? Un taller, una capacitación. Mm -hmm. She's going to be in a workshop to the research and development department to improve, para mejorar. The manufacturing process. El proceso de manufactura. What is she going to be doing at 7.15 in the morning? ¿Qué va a ser a las 7 y cuarto? Meeting with the marketing department. Meeting with the marketing department, right? She's going to be in a meeting with the marketing department. At 1.45? Second part of the workshop. And at 5.55? tomorrow. Send tomorrow. Send tomorrow. Send tomorrow. Send tomorrow. Send schedule. Right? Send tomorrow. Send Send tomorrow's schedule. 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 To Mrs. Lopez. Lopez. The new secretary, right? Send tomorrow's schedule to Mrs. Lopez, the new secretary. And leave what? And leave. Leave and leave, right? And you go and leave. So 
this is a schedule, right? Agenda. What is she going to do at 8.30 in the morning? Workshop. Video call with the supervisor. Video call with the supervisor. Supervisor from West Company. West Company. Okay, and at 12? Workshop. Workshop, Workshop lunch. lunch. Workshop lunch. Tell me, what time, what time, people, is the video call with West Company? Uh, at at 8.30. 8 8.30. 8.30. 8.30. 8.30. Okay. What time does the workshop with the research department start? The workshop with the research department. Nine. 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 At nine. nine o'clock. At nine o'clock. Very good. And what time does the company close? What time does the company close? Uh, five. 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 Okay. <laughs> si, ella, si ella se va a ir, si ella se va a ir a las 5.55, ¿a qué hora creen que cierre? Six o'clock. At six o'clock. <laughs> si cierran at five, ya quedo ahí para el día siguiente, ¿no? porque ya está mandando en la agenda. En ¿Y, cómo, ¿Y es ahora? Five fifty-five. Five fifty-five. Five No, 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 Y de ahí ocupamos los otros dos números, right? Five, 55. You can say five, ten, five, twenty-five. So, and you divide, right? You say five, ten, five, fifteen, five, twenty-five. Okay, you don't say five, two, five. No. <laughs> <laughs> so so how, se dice? Se, how do you say how do you say uno in English and they say one and how do you say eleven one one <laughs> <laughs> yeah one, one. so <laughs> that's like that's like the joke that when it says like que un chascarrillo había, ah, un chascarrillo le voy a contar un chascarrillo mm. que había mm. un muchacho a la orilla de una piscina y de repente vio que iba un gato corriendo y el gato se tiró a la piscina y como él no sabía inglés le tenía que avisar al dueño del gato ¿verdad? qué había pasado y le dice where's my cat where's my cat and he was looking for the cat right and the, have you seen my cat have you seen my cat and then there is like the, the el, el que no habla de inglés ¿verdad? no le vamos a poner nacionalidad para no ser racista el que no habla de inglés le dice de ah, <coughs> miau miau run and a pluch and no meow meow. <laughs> Así no, va a tocar. no, that's why you are here. That's why you are here. That's why you are here. You see? Por eso estamos aquí dedicando hasta dos horas de nuestra vida a no decir de, de miau miau, catapluch, push, no meow meow. De perro. Wow, wow, lo más. De wow, wow. <laughs> no, but you see. So say the cat, the cat jump on the water and no more meow meow. Mm. <laughs> yeah, it, it happens, right? It happens. So where is the cat? The cat is swimming. <laughs> okay, ese es otro chacarrillo para otro día. It's like um, okay. So this is a schedule. Yo les podría pasar contando chistes toda la noche. But <laughs> Mostly English jokes, right? English jokes. So here we have the schedules. In order to do this, I am going to go and practice something before, right? What time? The questions. What time is it? What time is it right now? Si le pregunto yo ahorita, what time is it right now? What time is it? 8.34. Eight, 8.34. Eight, 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 8.34, okay? In my computer, is 8.36. And in my phone, 8.34. So, what time is it? It's 
108. El cero en las cuestiones de tiempo es O. 108. You don't say 108. Si estamos hablando de tiempo, es O. Estamos hablando oh. de números de teléfono. O. Oh. Imagínense que su teléfono es, ok, 70, 44, eh, 21, 60. Es de el tuyo. No. You have my phone number. Come on. Ustedes tienen mi número ahí eh, en, su, en su WhatsApp. Ah, no, It pero says, personal. Yeah, that's my personal number. Ay, América. 70442160. That's how oh. you give a phone number. 7044. Oh. 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 Si va a llegar a América, oh, oh, va a llegar. Oh, 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 oh. Y con mi, mi número de teléfono, un montón de cero que tiene, oh, 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 oh. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, my God. Give me your phone number. Oh, 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 oh. No le, no le primero, le voy a decir, oh, 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 oh. El lunes te voy a llegar a preguntar el número de teléfono, a ver cómo va. Ay, no, no, no. Allí, compañero. Ay, ay, ay. Ya. Yeah. Oh, my God. Un cuando, cuando, la, cuando la risa se convierte en tos, es porque está ya grande. Seven, oh, 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 oh. Jamás he visto un número de teléfono 70 00 000. Ah, ¿cómo no? América. El mío. Ok, so there you go. What time is it? It's 1.08. 1.08. You don't say 1.08, right? It's 1.08. 1.08. The next one. What is the next question? What time does the uh -huh. meeting start? What time does the meeting start? What time does the meeting start? Right. What time does the meeting start? And there you have the options of this one. What time does the meeting start? What is the answer? It starts at 11 o'clock, okay? When you have shark times like this ones, cuando tienen números exactos, decimos 11 o'clock, okay? It is at 11 o'clock. O'clock significa? En punto. En punto, right? Hay oh. mucha gente que dice, por ejemplo, it's 11 o'clock a.m., right? 11 o'clock a.m. Y todavía le agregan in the morning. Si ya dice a.m., ya sabemos que es in the morning, yeah. right? It's not necessary to say a.m. in the morning, right? So you say it's at 11 o'clock. What time is the meeting? It's at 11 o'clock. What time do you arrive at work? At about, about significa at about, at about, at about is like más o menos, a las 6.48 a.m. What time do employees leave? Usually, usually around 7 or 7.30. 7 or 7.30. What is the meaning of this one? Around. 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 Alrededor, ah, menos, alrededor, usualmente alrededor de las siete, siete y media. ¿A qué hora llegas? Más o menos como a las seis cuarenta y ocho. At about six forty eight, right? That you arrive running to your job. It's like, good morning, I'm here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so at about six forty eight. So. If I ask you, what time do you arrive at work, people? What time do you arrive at work? ¿A qué hora llegan a su trabajo? At about 6.58. 6.58. <laughs> 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 
Y entra a las 7. Sí, pues sí. At 6.58. I will go one by one. Eh, Norma, what time do you arrive to your work? ¿A qué hora llegas al trabajo? At about um, six, um, 15. 6.15. Ronald Ulises? About 6.30. 6.30. Edwin? 6 at, six at 10 p.m. 6.10. 6 a las 6 y 10. Yes. 6.10 a.m. Roxana? Yeah. What time do you arrive to work? <laughs> 6 what? Thank you, Maggie. 6.30, 6.30, 6.30. Evelyn? 6.35. 6.35, Selena? 6.5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, 5. 6, Oh, <laughs> Isabel. About 6.45 a.m. 6.45 a.m. A.m. Griselda? At about 6.40 a.m. 6.40. Astrid? 6.30 a.m. 6.30 a.m. A.m. Américo? Ay, es 6.58. Américo a las 8 y ella es Américo. Es bien porque abrir la planta, llega y trabaja con los vigilantes. En Brenda Martínez. <risa> Brendita Martínez, what time do you arrive to work? Brendita se nos puede cuidar a la niña. Está, 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 está con permiso porque está cuidando a la niña. At, I arrive to work at 7. And I enter at 8, but I arrive at 7. In this one. <clears throat> It says here, and we have a couple of questions, but I wanted to go over something else first. Antes de irme con las preguntas, les voy a compartir otra cosa. Here I go. And I am going to go here. Okay. I think it's right here, but I am going to move it here. There we go. In this one, <clears throat> I wanted to make a little stop right? Because we were talking about the things that you do in your free time. What do you do in your free time before talking about the time itself? What do you do in a free, in your free time? And we have Richard and Julie. They work for the same company, but they have very different things that they do. I have Richard here and Julie right here. And it starts right here. So what do you do in your free time? Well, I often watch TV in the evening. What about you? I go jogging and I sometimes meet friends in the evening. How often do you go jogging? I go jogging every morning. And you? I hardly ever go jogging, maybe once a year. <clears throat> do you cook? No, I never cook. I always order pizza. And you? I cook every day. I love cooking. How often do you travel? I travel twice a year. In winter, I usually go skiing. Do you travel? Yes, I do, every summer, but I rarely travel in winter. I know that you have a lot of new vocabulary here. Questions? Preguntas? Hay mucho vocabulario nuevo aquí, vamos. Teacher, what's the meaning of? Teacher, jogging. Jogging. Good question. Okay, I'm going to write it here. Go jogging. Go jogging is when you go out and run, right? Not running like, ah, 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 ah. no, jogging is like when you go, like, well, how do you call that in Spanish? Trotar, salir a trotar. So you go jogging, just like, yeah. Any other me, question? A me parecía correr. Yeah, pero no es como correr. Correr is run. Que vas como más rápido. Jogging es como salir a trotar, salir a correr así despacito. And rarely. 
I rarely, uh, rarely. It's like rare. maybe once a year. Una vez al año, raramente. Winter. Winter. We have four seasons. We have four seasons. We have summer. We have summer, winter. We have fall and let me see. The next one is summer, winter, fall, and rain. No, no, rain. Well, rain is winter for us. Um, I am missing one. And spring. There you go. Yes, I may be that. Y solo falta un millón. There you go. Autumn. Autumn is the same fall. Fall, fall or autumn. Autumn. Ese es otoño. Mm. Okay, we have summer, winter, fall, and spring. Summer is verano. Winter is invierno. Fall is otoño or autumn, right? And spring is primavera. So we have the four different seasons, right? Summer, winter, fall, and spring. In this case, it says, I go every summer. El va cada verano. Pero nunca viaja en invierno. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes, I do. Every summer. But I rarely travel in winter. That is the wow. meaning of uh, winter. Invierno. In El Salvador, we have only summer and winter. Marcadas totalmente, solo tenemos invierno y verano. Pero si se fijan ahí yeah. por octubre, noviembre... Si sí, vivimos el otoño y ahorita estamos viviendo la primavera. Todas flores por todos lados. Spring. Right? So, tenemos dos estaciones muy marcadas y las otras que se viven intermitentes. Aquí hay it, una, hay una que dice juego porque está juego aquí. No, yeah, right now. <laughs> That is very. <laughs> so, any other question about vocabulary? I travel, teacher. I travel twice a year. I travel twice a year. I no. travel twice a year, two times. I travel a twice a year. Viajo dos veces al año. Oh. Any other one? Once a year? No, it's a año. Exactly like that. Any other question? You have Johnny. Hardly going down. I hardly ever, hardly, hardly ever, it's like, Teacher, allá en donde cuando se muere un lagarto. I hardly ever, casi nunca. Hardly ever is casi nunca. Hardly ever. Hardly. No Harley Davidson. Hardly ever. Es uh, diferente. <coughs> yeah, Harley Davidson is the, the brand. Esa es la marca. I hardly ever, casi nunca. Ya no necesita nada. No, that's the name. Es el, el nombre. Harley Davidson. What about never? Nunca. Nunca. Always? Siempre. 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 Sometimes? Algunas veces. veces. Often? Oh. Often? Oh. Como rara vez. No. Mm. Seguido. Seguido. I often. Ajá. I often watch TV in the evening. I often watch TV in the evening. What Oops. about you? Y vos? What about you? A menudo, often. I often. Ok, ¿qué hay de ti? Sería esta. ¿Qué hay de ti? En buen salvadoreño, ¿y vos? What about you? ¿Qué onda? ¿Qué onda vos? <laughs> no, ¿qué onda vos es WhatsApp? Exactamente. Es like, what in the WhatsApp, man? No. What about What's you? Up? It's like, ¿y vos? <laughs> so, what do you do in your free time? You are going to be Richard. Ustedes me contestan. So, what do you do in your free time? Well, well, well often uh, watch TV. Well, 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 about you. About you. About you. Well, oh. I often watch TV in the evening. 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 What about you? I, I go, go jogging, jogging and I sometimes, sometimes meet, meet friends, friends in the evening. In the evening. Oh. How, How often, often, do often did you go jogging? Do you go jogging? I go jogging every morning, and you? 
Do you cook? No, I, I never cook. I, 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 I always, always order pizza. And you? I cook every day. I love cooking. How often? How often? How often? Travel. Do you travel? travel? I travel twice a year in winter. I usually go skiing. Do you travel? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. I rarely travel, 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 travel in winter. winter. Okay, winter. practice with me often. Sometimes. Sometimes. Evening. How often? How often? How often? Hardly How ever. Hardly ever. Never. 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 Always. 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 Usually. 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 Rarely. 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 How Sometimes. often do you? How, How often do you? How often do you travel? How often do you travel? How often do you cook? How often do you cook? How often do you study? How often do you study? How often do you clean the house? How often do you clean the house? How often do you take a shower? How often do you take a shower? How often do you How often do you listen to music? How often do you listen to music? How often do you check your cell phone? How often do you check How often do you check your email? How often do you check your email? How often do you check your email? Ajá, aquí vengo a la pregunta del día. De inglés corporativo les pueden enviar el, eh, ¿cómo se llama? Alguna documentación, información o algo en su correo. Así que, check your email. I mean, a little bit often. Check your email often, ¿ok? From time to time. Denle ahí una revisadita, ¿no? Va a ser que se hayan perdido alguna información. So, I am going to practice again. So, mm -hmm. what do you do in your free time? So, what do you do, what do, you do in your free time? Okay, ahora sí, pregúntenmelo. No, so, what do you do in your free time? Okay, so, so what do you, do, do, you do, do in your free time? time? So, Very good, do do very good. Time? So, what do you do in your free time? Well, <laughs> so, what do you do in your free time? Well, I often watch TV in the evening. What about you? I, I watch TV. I watch TV in the watch TV so Sunday in the morning. Every evening. And you meet friends in the evening. How often do you go jogging, people? I go jogging every morning. Every morning. And you? I hardly ever go jogging. Maybe once a year. Do you cook? Do you, Do cook? you cook? No, I never cook. I always order pizza. And you? I cook. I cook every day. How often do you travel? I travel every day. You usually go skiing. Do you travel? You travel. Yes, I do every summer, but I rarely travel in winter. Now you start, okay? Ustedes comienzan y yo les contesto. One, two, and three. So, what do you do in your free time? Um, I often watch TV in the evening. What about you? I go to the I sometimes meet friends in the evening. How often do you go jogging? I, I, jogging every morning. 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 I hardly ever go jogging, maybe once a year. Do you, do you do you cook? Cook? No, I never cook. I always order pizza. And you? I, 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 cook every every day. Day. I love, I love cooking. cooking. How often do you travel? I, I travel. I usually go to travel. Do you travel? A ski. A ski. Yes, I do. Every summer, but I rarely travel in winter. 
Okay. So skin. if I is skin, you say skin, skin. 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 People, what do you do in your free time? Well, I go to the I go jogging and I sometimes meet friends in the evening. How often do you? How often do you go? How often do you go oh. jogging? How often do you go jogging? I go jogging every morning. And you? I I do you cook? I never, 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 I cook every day. I love cooking. How often do you travel? I travel? I travel twice a year in winter. I usually go skiing. Do you travel? Yes, yes, I do. I really travel in winter. In winter. Good. Very good job. Tell me, people, something that you always do, something that you always do on Sundays. Something that you always do on Sundays. ¿Qué de ley? Usted el domingo lo hace porque lo hace siempre. What is something that you always do on Sundays? I go to the supermarket. I go to the supermarket, right? I go to the supermarket. So you say, I always go to the supermarket on Sundays, right? I always go to the supermarket on Sundays. What is something that you up. do? Uh -huh. I wake up late. So you say, I always... Wake up late. When? Cuando? <laughs> On Sundays. Sunday. On Sundays. Dígame otra cosa que hacen solamente los domingos. Levantarme tarde. Uh -huh. I always wake up late on Sundays. You say, do you go to church? ¿Quién va a la iglesia? Aquí lo diablo. No. <laughs> <laughs> No, I go to yeah, church. No you are David. You are David. David, David, David. David. Te acojo la teacher para la iglesia. Por favor. América. De la oreja me lo voy a llevar a todos. No, hay algunas que van a la iglesia. <laughs> Yo no voy porque después de caer. Se quiebra el espejo, se cae en la iglesia. ¿Cómo es? Américo. <laughs> Me acuerdan mañana de traer agua bendita. Oiga, por favor. Mañana no, no, mañana me voy a conectar yo. Ah, tomorrow is Sunday. It's Saturday. Oh my God, it's Sunday. Ya ando en el domingo. Eh? Okay, so tell me something that you always do on... Oh, sorry. Something that you always do in the morning. The sleep? I always I sleep take in the shower. morning. I always take a shower, right? I always take a shower. Another I thing that always, you always do in the morning, I always, uh -huh. I always, I always watch TV, always, Premier League. I, I always. <laughs> yes, Grisel. I always buy bread. I always buy bread. Edwin, you always watch TV where? Ah, play in the morning. Yes, every 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 Monday, every Sunday. Uh, every Sunday, okay, yeah, estábamos bien. Watch TV. I always watch TV, right, on the bus. <laughs> I always watch TV, right? Tell like. me, tell me something that you always do after class. Something that you always do after class. I take my brush. No, I brush my teeth. I always. Copy. I did my I brush. Go. I teeth my brush. I brush my teeth. I, I brush, brush my teeth. Your diente mi cepillo. Se me fue, se fue. What is something that you always do after class? Se acaba la clase y usted qué hace? That's justo cuando se acaba la clase. I always copy. I always go to sleep. I always go to sleep. Uh-huh. 
I always take I, notes. Uh -huh. I always check my cell phone. I always check yeah. my cell phone. Uh -huh. All the, todas las fans ahí, ¿no? <laughs> Mira, si no lo apoyan en el aprendizaje, no les haga caso. Ah, no, si Edwin está casado, pues no. Ni la lejos. <laughs> Sí, no, esposas aquí, nadie lee nada. No, no. What do you do after class? Selena, what do you do after class? Always. What do you always do after class? I sleep. I go to sleep. I have, I have a, um, I, this is like a game that I have with my son. Yo tengo como un, una, un, como un jueguito con mi hijo. ¿verdad? Exactly when I finish the class, I say, it's over, and I yell, right? Yo le grito, se acaba, <laughs> when I finish. So he comes mm. running, right? Cuando me, escucha, over. cuando me escucha gritar, él viene corriendo. Right? <laughs> so, cuando no viene corriendo, es que ya se durmió. So that's my checking point, when I finish the class. So something that we always do on Friday is that we go to bed early, right? And this is the moment for you to go. On Monday, we are going to study adverbs of frequency. Vamos a estudiar adverbios de frecuencia y el tiempo. ¿Okay? Así que si se pueden ir a estudiar cómo decir la hora, el reloj y todo eso durante el fin de semana, that would be perfect. ¿Okay? So, there you have the homework. I need you to investigate about adverbs of frequency and the time. ¿Okay? So, you have homework to do during this weekend. Have a fantastic night, my dear students, and I'm going to see you on Monday for the next class. Okay, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. <laughs> okay, I will see you again tomorrow. No. Mañana clase privada aquí con él. On Monday, on Monday. See you on Monday, people. Have a wonderful Ooh. night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Sleep time. Se acabó. Se acabó. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye-bye, dear students. Love you. Bye-bye.